uh, let's now take a look back at what's making news headlines uh, this hour. Former ANC Treasurer General Matthew Sposa has entered the party leadership race. He accepted an endorsement from the Western Cape ANC branches. Meanwhile, senior party member Lindy Uesisuru says it would be premature and wrong for her to announce whether she will be available or should avail herself to stand as party as president of the party. Now speaking at the Lili Ngoi lecture at Kailicha outside Cape Town, Sisulu wouldn't outright say if she will stand as candidate if nominated. However, she said it was time for the ANC and the country to be led by a woman. The Banking Association of South Africa has expressed relief that President Jacob Zuma has finally signed the FICA bill into law. Zuma took about two months to approve the bill after Parliament passed it. Baza says the signing of the bill will ensure that banks in the country remain on the cutting edge of global best practice. Law experts and politicians have also welcomed the bill. They say it bolsters the fight against financial crime and the bill makes it easier to identify the ultimate owners of companies and accounts. It will help prevent money laundering and the financing of terror. You know, sports, Orlando Pirates has moved into the top eight of the upset premiership after beating a 10-man Chippa United 2-1 at the Orlando Stadium. Goals from Tamsang Nakabuza and Tabu Mataba boosted Pirates' fortunes. Meanwhile, Super Sport United came back twice from a goal down to earn a 2 all draw against Kaiser Chiefs in a league encounter at Bombela Stadium in Northbridge.